Hi, my name is Peter Clark, and I ask that you please view my detailed campaign platform at peterclarktoronto.com. The dust has now settled from the recent civic worker strike and from the outrageous chronic spending habits by the incumbent councillor from Ward 23 over the past eight years. Some of his spending was for failed and costly projects like the Vendors a la Carte program, which was poorly thought through by the 20-year incumbent. And then, with its failure, this program and costs were quickly moved from under his direction within the city's health department to that of another. Quite similar to the e-health disaster and mismanagement, but on a smaller scale. The current councillor had a chance to show his awareness of Toronto's financial problems, but unfortunately, he chose not to and voted yes to increase overall spending by 4%, even though he had the option to be physically prudent by reducing spending by 2%. He failed. He failed the taxpayers again this year and voted yes to increase spending by $188 million for unnecessary and questionable expenses during our city's ongoing financial problems. And now, the taxpaying public has been left with the realization that our city's purse and reserve funds are almost empty. Toronto's long-term debt will become a tax burden for our children's children, thanks to such policies. I strongly believe that now is the time for a change. If we are to restore any fiscal responsibility and move forward in a sustainable, transparent and financially responsible manner, if not, the 20-year career incumbent will continue his politics of increasing taxpayers' debt through chronic spending, borrowing, and by finding new taxing policies to pass on to the next generation, which I believe responsible citizens will no longer tolerate. Your taxes, one city, your vote, and our financial future together on October 25th. Please visit my campaign website at peterclarktoronto.com and compare my proposals to those of the incumbent councillor and others. Hopefully you will agree and vote to endorse my platform of controlled spending with cuts through openness and transparency. I thank you for taking the time to listen to my views and urge you to exercise your right and civic duty by voting for the candidate of your choice on October 25th. Thank you and God bless.